This is the time when the talking has to stop and the action finally begins. A warm welcome to Wembley from me, Derek Ray. I'm joined on the commentary box by Lee Dixon, and we're just seconds away from kickoff time in what promises to be a wonderful Carabao Cup final. It is Manchester City up against Tottenham Hotspur. Well, not many players in their careers get chances to play in cup finals. These 22 have got a perfect opportunity to put their name on the map. I'm looking forward to this final. It should be an absolute cracker, Derek. Number 26, Riyad Mahrez. And number 7, Raheem Sterling. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson starts in goal. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Kevin De Bruyne starts with Rodri in central midfield. And the responsibility of leading the line goes to Gabriel Jesus. Introducing the Spurs starting 11. And this is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. Yeah, most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them. But it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. Thank you for attending Wembley Stadium. Enjoy the game. And the match begins. Gundogan. And City being afforded too much room. And teammates to play it to. Steven Bergwijn. Kane. Now Sissoko. Right place to cut out the pass. Well, if you're looking for a player to finesse his way through a match, look no further than Kevin De Bruyne at Lee. His qualities are there for all to see. Well, Derek, every time I see him play, I see a pass that I think cannot be bettered. And five minutes later, he goes and beats it. His vision and execution of passing is the best in the world. End of. It's got to be! Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Corner awarded. But he's gone short with it. Shot attempted. Tremendous block. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Pabier over the top intended for Son. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Strong but fair tackle. Gabriel Jesus. Here's Mares. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Just cutting off the supply. And a throw in for Manchester City, it'll be. Rodri. Ruben Diaz. The ball with Rodri. Excellent passing. De Bruyne. Mares. And Manchester City missed the chance to make it 1-0. Oh, and what a chance it was, and what a fluff line that is. Eric Dyer. Now Sissoko. Fabier, Sissoko, Steven Bergwijn, Kane, Ndombele, and smart defending. Well, they really had to be on their toes defensively given the circumstances. Over the touchline for a throw in. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. 
Kane. Son. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. It could have been awkward for the goalkeeper. Maybe a chance for Spurs here to take the lead from a corner. Over it comes. Kane, a pot with a block. Nothing in it, Derek, is there? Just testing each other out tactically. It's fascinating. Who will buckle first? Sterling. And Gundogan untidy with the ball at his feet. Sissoko. And City have possession once more. Rebier. Kane. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Another well, stoppage time situation. One minute here. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. That is that for the first half here. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Reguilon. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Harry Kane. And it's Harry Kane on the run. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Walker. De Bruyne. Gabriel Jesus now. Gundogan. Gabriel Jesus. And you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Aurier, Sissoko, here's Lo Celso, Harry Kane, and Hoybier with it, Lo Celso, and no luck keeping possession. Joao Cancelo. Gabriel Jesus now. Rodri. Gundogan. Here's Gabriel Jesus. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Out of play for a Manchester City throw in. Spurs to make a personnel switch now. Joao Cancelo. It's a promising City move. De Bruyne. Now Walker. Gundogan. Well, if only he had timed his run slightly better. Offside.
Pabier. Advantage, Spurs. De Bruyne. Mares. Gabriel Jesus. Here's Mares. De Bruyne. Rodri. Here's Gabriel Jesus. It did look on for them, but not to be. Pabier. Harry Kane. Now room to roam for Spurs on the wing. And here now come Tottenham. A goal at this late stage could settle the issue. And a goal kick given. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Bernardo Silva. And Manchester City moving the ball with purpose. Rodri. And now Sterling. Well read to ease the pressure. And it's a case of just five minutes left. Pabier. Spurs still on the attack with the minutes ticking away. Can they find a winner? Could cross it in here. Well, in some style, Edison prevents a goal. Well, this corner could be pivotal. It might represent the last chance to get in front in the dying moments. Now the delivery. Now the keeper dealt with the danger. A final that will live long in the memory. It's not finished yet because it's going to come down to a penalty shootout to settle the outcome. And now it is all about the penalty shootout. He's gambled on direction and won. Well, he's got his angles right there. Just look at that for goalkeeping. And just like that, he's come up with the save. Well, you have to have strong hands as a goalkeeper. And look at that. And he succeeds in finding the bottom corner. An ex-penalty taker myself. I love it when it goes in the net. And he's denied them from the spot. Oh, it's lovely goalkeeping, really is. Oh, he saved it. Well, the goalkeeper guessed, but he guessed the right way. Good save. Job done from the spot. Well, professional job. Well done. He's gambled on direction and won. Well, he's got his angles right there. Just look at that for goalkeeping. And he's taken the low road. Beautifully done. Well, he picked a corner, head down. Good penalty. Well, the responsibility is on his shoulders. Failure to score and they lose. He scored in the bottom corner. Well, you make it hard for the goalkeeper and that's a really difficult place for him to get to. It comes down to this, a goal, and they win the game. Too much elevation off the top of the barley. Well, inches away from being a great penalty. And he's tucked his penalty away, Lee. Well, he held his nerve, simple as that. And it's gone in. Well, the sweet sound of the ball hitting the net. Superb placement there. Practice makes perfect, Derek. And now it is truly final. What? 
one team in raptures, the other disconsolate. What an ending. Well, you can talk about the merits of penalty shootouts to decide big tournaments, big games. So much nerves of steel are needed. A little bit of a gamble here and there. Who's going to come out on top? But the end result is there for all to see. Well, they're not going to forget this in a hurry. A proud moment but for the losers. It's a case of trying to forget about everything that has just occurred. Well, just the point, Derek. Always be respectful of the losers. Yes, you're in raptures. You're celebrating with your mates. Always took time to go to the opposition and say, unlucky. The party has started. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here. Well, it's these moments, Derek, when you get your hands on the silverware and that little medal that goes round your neck might seem small now, but you'll look back at that, show your grandkids absolutely superb memories these players will have of this game. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Yeah, it's been a long old road to get to this point. They're going to celebrate now and certainly celebrate long into the night, I think. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. And this is really special, getting to celebrate in front of your own fans, Lee. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations, go into the crowd and give them the cup. That's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee. Now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, you know exactly where I'd be sitting in that photo, don't you, Derek? <laughs> I think I've heard it before, Lee. <laughs> Straight at the front. 